Is that parent actually being a good friend or just a stupid, really idiot? He's he's too girls. he's too dumb to recognize that it would be in his interest to try and get Rand to dump Egwene. <laughs> exactly. Uh, it's it is so terrible that they turned the character who's like strongest sort of affinity is wisdom right like if you if you think of him as like an rpg character and he's like he's got his, his sort of like skill kind of tree right wisdom is the thing that is most most associated with perrin's character and they turn him into a mumbling fucking mouth breathing idiot <laughs> like oh no no the I fact gotta that ask he, the fact that it's, he doesn't walk around drooling on camera is astounding so, so Pips, if Perrin was a D and D character, what would his stats be? Show uh, Perrin, show, show, show Perrin, strength uh, like two. He's never worked out in his life. Come on, and he's not I the guess, blacksmith. Well, I guess he's got you got to what is it? You got to roll three dice, right? So he's he's yeah, gonna have a three. He's gonna have a three of strength. No, one one one. That's tough to do. That's like the weakest possible. Yeah, you got to give him average, like ten strength. No, he's, he's 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 lower than average. I it's guarantee mostly you, fat. All I right, I'll give him a nine. That Egwene would beat him in an arm wrestle if that ever happened on camera. True enough. All right, so we will give him eight strength, dexterity, like a um, like a six. He's clumsy okay. as hell. Yeah. Constitution. He looks he, like he does have that. He does have that leg wound, and then the wolf licks it, and he's yeah. healthy in like the next. So he's probably got like. 19 mm, constitution no, like no, no, superhuman no. level because he he what? had to recover for like a full-on day after getting healed from scratches on his back oh true enough so and that's got to knock him down a bit too he's breathing heavy after like yelling he can't have that great <laughs> he's he's got he's got asthma <laughs> he's got asthma <laughs> so he's like nine constitution um regardless of being six foot four and 200 pounds yep uh, intelligence like I said, three. Three definitely. All right. <laughs> I'm not gonna fight you on that. Wisdom. The wise parent character. Also, I think I think he's gotta be he's just a bumbling idiot on both of those. He he was actually thinking about going with the veganism sort of way, way of the leaf. All right, so that's gotta be a three too. Yes. And then charisma. So his ability to uh uh influence other people. Uh so he I don't think he convinces anyone to follow him into veganism. He did make Rand back down in their face off. So, so he, he passed one bluff check. Yeah. So, so I don't, I don't but know. But it's against Rand El El Simp. Yeah, that's, so that's true. Give him a six maybe on charisma. Yep, he sounds what, sounds like a terrible what, role. What we're going for here is that somehow show Perrin has got worse stats than Lady Balefire's D and D character <laughs> um, from our A D and D campaign with OBG, which you guys can tune in on Monday nights every other Monday. That is yeah. true. Dane, you just—that's the most genius idea—is to roll up an actual D and D party based on the show characters and see how far you could survive in a dungeon. You would, you would die. Like what? Like what's the point? You would, you'd waste all that time, and then you'd just be dead. <laughs> you see an orc, you die. Huh? Pretty much. Oh, well, you failed the save. Okay, probably. All right. 